Hi, what's up? This is Zero MD, and this is vlog number 37. This one's entitled No More Look, Listen, and Feel for BLS 2021 and Beyond. If you are new to this show, welcome. Glad to have you on board. Today we'll be discussing this skill called the Look, Listen, and Feel. To those new to BLS, this skill has not been taught for a decade. In the instruction, to those who don't know what BLS is, it means basic life support. It's a course conducted all over the world to the emergency care providers. This is certifiable and you have to renew it every two years to be able to provide basic emergency cardiovascular care. This course is also taught to laypersons in an awareness level. The problem is not because the guidelines to this curriculum changes every five years, it's that a lot of first responders are still practicing outdated procedures. When I ask, why is this so? A lot of first responders, especially in my country, only undergo the awareness level or the free trainings provided by the Red Cross. Once they got through it, most of them do not take the time to update the skill. Again, why? The course is costly. To get updated here in the Philippines, an individual first responder has to spend somewhere between $100 to $200, and that's a lot converted to Philippine pesos. Even when you are employed as a local government rescuer, you have to deduct this to this to your small salary. Incentives do not exist and the cost is usually equivalent to an average month's salary. This leaves the responder to seek free BLS trainings that are often outdated or they stick to what they know. The look, listen, and feel has been deprecated since 2010. You're not supposed to use it anymore. And today, it's 2021 and we are still in the middle of, co of the COVID pandemic. Doing the look, listen, and feel will put you and your family at greater risk of contracting the COVID infection. Now, before we get to the how, a little word from my sponsor. Cyberlink Power Director has been around since I started on YouTube last 2009. Most of my vlogs has been edited with it, but I wasn't able to keep up with the technology and I found that editing on a PC is much more costly and time-consuming. Thankfully, I discovered that Power Director is now on mobile. It's available on iOS and Android platforms, and you can start the full featured version for free. If you like it, you can continue using the app for 1,550 pesos per year, and you can make all the YouTube videos that you want. The surprising thing is that it's compatible in most smartphones, and it gives you the chance to edit on the go. Check out my link at bit.ly slash 0MD Power Director for more info. Now what is look, listen, and feel? It's a three-step maneuver that is done simultaneously to check for the ABCs or airway, breathing, and circulation. When you find a patient unconscious, you go to the side of a patient and lean forward with a part of your face in close proximity to the patient's mouth. Your eyes should be looking at the patient's chest, watching for the indrawing of air to check for breathing. At the same time, you are listening or feeling for a draft of the air coming out of the patient's mouth to check if the airway is patent. Also, at the same time, your fingers should be feeling for the patient's carotid pulse to check for the circulation. To those who know the procedure, good for you. I have been practicing it since 2006 when I graduated med school. I have been able to save lives using this time-saving procedure, but doing it now can get you COVID. Recently, I quarantined an entire shift of EMS personnel after at least one of them did this procedure on a cardiac arrest patient. My suspicion was verified when the post-mortem RT-PCR swab revealed that the patient had COVID prior to dying. The cardiac arrest was his only symptom. The guy who did the procedure tested positive and had symptoms. Lesson. 
get updated with the new guidelines. If you have to do the look, listen and feel maneuver, make sure to have adequate personal protective equipment when doing so. When in doubt, just follow the prevailing guidelines. Report if you have symptoms. Always put your safety first so you don't become the victim. Thank you guys for watching. If you like this video, click that thumbs up sign and hit the subscribe button because you are awesome. Hit the bell and choose all to get notified when a new vlog will come out. Comment down below and let me know what you think and questions are welcome. So just type those questions down below on the comment section and thank you guys for watching. This is ZeroMD signing off.